received. Inside, up and under. Doesn't go for McDonald. Meanwhile, that's Travis Ware showing some range, but not hitting. Rebound. 37% three-point shooter, so they can make those shots. Stewart all the way. No, Bernardo rebound. Go! Additional possession for his team. Good timing. Turner, long ball. Bernardo. White. Thinking he's about to get beat. Oh, and he's on the drive. He got into the paint, but couldn't get it to go. Nearly man to man. They better tighten up on three point shooters. And as soon as you do, oh, you picked up on I that. have. And Vinok all by himself. Waited for contributions from Warren and White. Bosk to Bernardo rolling. Good look. A lot of energy right now out of Mississippi State starters. Bernardo, again, his paws are so good as a shot blocker. And thought better of it. Now Bernardo has it, and they're running at it. Johnson. That, obviously, his first of the day. Jarvis Bernardo back in. He sat a good chunk of the first half. As he dishes out. And that's a three. Spot, though they brought him in to play the three. 6'10 freshman from Tampa, Jarvis. Win playing away from Chapel Hill this season. Bernardo, a little jump shot, and it goes on. Half court trap there at the top. Bernardo, how much are they going to give him? He'll pull up. Beanock into Bernardo. Bernardo. Again, they get it down low to Bernardo, but he had it. The entry pass into Bernardo. Offense, not on defense, and Mississippi State is doing a good job of it. Boss missed a three. Bernardo, long arm to rebound on the baseline, and that is goaltender. Block more shots than anybody ever in college basketball. Here he is on offense. Feel for where the rim is, and he keeps a cushion off of the ball. We got great inside nice. position that time. Let's play like this all season long. DeMarcus Cousins tied up by the game. They are not going to double Patterson, but they're going to come hard with a double. 3.38 left. DeMarcus Cousins and a tie up. Bernardo will never be the first guy off the floor. You can The first go around in Starkville, same story today. Underneath. I will be so sharp tomorrow as I head to Gainesville because I'm going to stay in one. There's the numbers that back it up. Oh, nice look inside. We have a one-point game. Bernardo. Turner, the extra pass underneath. And a slam by the extra pass. A little scramble for the basketball. Augustus coming up with it. Challenge of the defense comes in help. And a little nice little soft pass underneath to Bernardo with the finish. How about the touch from the 6-8-4? Run a foul call. I thought they had an opportunity for one there. Bernardo. And he blocked it on one end, and there's there to clean it up on the other. Ten strides for a big guy, rim to rim, is very, very good. That shot's blocked by Phil Turner, and here comes Stewart. The alley oop, but oh! one handed finish. This was actually a little bit behind him. Bernardo going out, catching it, and sending it over the top. Here we go, coming at you. But can get out transition, catch it on the punch over the top. Reese, I talked to Bernardo a couple of weeks ago for about 15 minutes about blocking his shot. Another thing that he has really figured out, he reads the eyes of the offensive player very well because the eyes are going to take where the basketball is about to go. And until the eyes raise towards the rim, Bernardo doesn't get ready to raise himself. On the day for the nation's leading. You get to see Jarvis Bernardo again. Look at his ability to read. Liggins got his man in the air and he goes airborne. Nobody can handle before he can go up and under. Patrick Patterson, tough catch in deep. Harris, but no call. And now John Wall against Bernardo rejected. Foul. John Wall takes it right in to the all-time best shot blocker in the history of the college game. And he does it. 
Two for five, John Wall. Only the third personal foul on Bernardo. That time he got a little buried underneath the rim. He cannot predetermine what he's going to do with that basketball coming off the on-ball screen. He's got 117 here. Reese, he never leaves the floor until the offense... On his way to the basket, but Ole Miss retains possession. Here's Polonies thinking long and hard against Bernardo, and Bernardo might not have gotten the block shot, but he made him see the second guy off the floor. Cranston enjoyed the first try so much, he wanted to do it again. Same result. Henry and Bernardo get himself up defensively. He gets out from underneath the Ole Miss looking at that state zone. Holloway, and Bernardo's got another Which is anything. Fourth block of the night for Bernardo, and I will. Johnson could not finish deep box the nice pass. That's when we had to stop it. Watch right. Uh, here's the action. Boom. There's the first elbow from Henry, and Bernardo comes back at him. I think